guys Ivan here and welcome to new video so in this video we will check out the new SL but before that we will check out the history predecessor cars so this is the Mercedes-Benz 190 SL from 1955 up to 1963 look how stunning it looks in the silver like silver arrows and also this year is 55 year anniversary of the AMG so this one is uh, the Mercedes-Benz 230 SL from 1963 up to 1971. You can see the wheels which have like a monoblock style which we can see now on the newer models. So this was back then very popular to have these kind of wheels which are covered uh, whole so we cannot see the brakes and you can see similar design language with the 190 and also this cream like color so next one is Mercedes-Benz 350 SL from 1971 up to 1989 and also similar style wheels and very nice red interior but as you can see here the front design is changed to that one in the previous model so this was a short history of the previous generation of the SL and now we have the brand new generation of the SL so it's coming back to the not Mercedes-Benz now but the Mercedes AMG because this one is only AMG model you cannot get this car as a Mercedes-Benz so here is the Mercedes AMG SL we have 63, 55 and also 43 models and if you like this video give this video a like don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell and turn on all notifications so you are notified for all future episodes so here I want to show you shortly this 63 version in sun yellow with aero package and in detail in this video we will check out the red SL but here I wanted to show you how the 63 looks with aero package and we will take a look at this model in future episode so here is the Mercedes AMG SL55 Formatic Plus in Manufacture Patagonia Red Metallic take a look how bright this car looks under the sunshine so for the new AMG SL as I told you we have SL43, SL55 and SL63 this one, the red one is the 55 model so the middle one and if you take a look at the engines, the 55 and 63, they share the same V8 engine. And the 43 has the new four-cylinder. So that's the difference between these three models. So the 55 has lower powered output and it's uh, configured more for a comfortable drive as a GT Roadster. And the 63 was developed to offer you more of a sporty character in the SL. So the 55 is ideal for a as a Grand Tourer vehicle. The very nice AMG multi-spoke light alloy wheels in chrome finish, in silver finish and with Michelin Pilot Sport 4S tires to offer the most of the grip. These are the 21 inch wheels, also yellow brake calipers and also we have night package here. Here you can see the badge V8 by Turbo Formatic Plus on the front fender and also the door handles which you know from the S-Class which pop out so really amazing details so now let's take a look at the front design here you can see this aggressive front shark like design with AMG specific grille in the high gloss black as part of the night package too also we have a digital light technology LED which can project symbols and lanes and cut out ongoing traffic really really amazing and also the front bumper is really aggressive so on the yellow we are calling the yellow 63 you could see the arrow package here we don't have it but still the car looks really great to me personally it looks very elegant in this spec with Patagonia Manufacture red bright metallic and these wheels they are really stunning in my opinion I really like this spec personally the red paint and silver wheels also you can get the black wheels but uh, yeah these are more elegant pallet sport forest tires for the most grip and yellow brake calipers so very very nice and you can see here the really bright interior we will check this shortly 
So now we can take a look at the side and rear profile. So here you can see the sloping design and the new SL is actually larger than the GT Roadster, which is kind of predecessor. So there is no more GT Roadster in the offer. And also there is no S-Class Cabriolet or S-Class Coupe. So the SL fits uh, somewhere in between these two models, the GT Roadster is uh, smaller than the new SL and the S-Class Cabriolet is obviously a larger one. This one is like a mix of these two cars I would say in terms of the size and just about everything. So I think it's really really a great uh, model in my opinion because this model gives you just enough sportiness from uh, the sporty character and sporty platform but it's not as huge so you can cut very nicely corners in this vehicle. So here you can see the four squared exhaust pipes and four fins on the diffuser. The lower part of the bumper is in high gloss black and the whole car has very nice rear design. Let me know how to like these guys in the comment section down below. I'm really curious to hear your thoughts. Also with the aero package you can get the underside of the rear diffuser and also flicks in the bumper. Alright, so now we can take a look at the interior. You can see the new uh, displays and also this very nice AMG performance steering wheel. So this one is the Manufacture Napa Leather in Macchiato Beige and Titan Grey. You can see the demon stitching on the seats and AMG logos. Very very nice interior in my opinion. So this is also now 2 plus 2 seater. You can fold the rear seats or you can have it for child seat and in my opinion this is really great. You can also put the golf bag in the rear and fold down the seats. So really amazing in my opinion. So let me know how to like this design also with hyper analog interior. So in terms of engine variants the new SL you can get it as a 4355 and also the 63. So the 43 has 381 horsepower, the 55 has 476 horsepower and the 63 has 585 horsepower. So the SL55 can sprint from 0 to 100 km per hour or 62 miles per hour in only 3.6 seconds and has 800 newton meters of torque and that's 590 pound-feet of torque. The engine is mated to AMG Speed Shift MCT9G, so multi-clutch transmission for very fast and engaging shifts. And the top speed is electronically limited to 315 km per hour, and that's 196 miles per hour. Also, the Formatic Plus gives you the all-wheel drive system, so this car will be great even in winter season and you can get the roof in black red and also gray color all right guys so let me know how you like this new mercedes amg sl 55 formatic let me know in the comment section down below thank you very much for watching and don't forget to subscribe give this video a like and i will see you soon in the next video have a wonderful day